When Barrett's body was found yesterday morning near I-20 in Glenwood, investigators at first saw enough breaks in the pattern not to add his name immediately to the list. However, they acknowledged enough similarities to add his name. Well, this morning, lab tests confirmed that enough trace evidence was found that connected this recent murder to some others. And you've got a situation where you've got basically the age, the race, uh, the background of the individual involved, uh, the type of method of death, uh, the type of trace evidence that was developed, uh, all of these things uh, put them together in a very similar pattern, uh, similarity with the others. One source close to this case says puncture wounds were found on the body that apparently were inflicted after the teenager died. Chief Hand would not comment. He did say that investigators were not able to lift fingerprints from the body, but that his murder was very similar to that of Patrick Balthazar, apparently strangled the same way. Now DeKalb County and the task force will try to retrace Barrett's movements before his death. He was last seen around 5 Monday afternoon in the Kirkwood section of DeKalb County. According to the medical examiner, that was possibly only hours before his death. Ernie Bjorkman, Action News.